Oh, hello. I think this is the Rainbow Show, that variety show with all the stuff in it, and I'm pretty sure I'm in it too. You won't believe all the great things I have in store for you in this episode until, until you watch the rest of it, and then you'll be like, yeah, I, I buy that. Actually, I don't really know what's in store either because it's randomized. We're gonna pick a card randomly, and we're gonna start with that segment. How about this one? Purple! <laughs> I hate talking about pop culture. Boy, do I. I'm gonna go to a celebrity gossip website that will remain unnamed. Okay, Myla Kunis looks sleepy in oversized jacket as she picks up an iced coffee in LA. I have an equally important news story to share with you. A molecule of air just moved a few seconds ago. Also, doesn't everyone over 30 look sleepy all the time? We're doing our best. That's why makeup tutorials are so popular. How to look less sleepy. Step one, acceptance. You are sleepy. Mark Wahlberg says, I love you, buddy, after he supports DJ Khalid at his Air Jordan 3 unveiling. Who cares what one person said to another person? Mark Wahlberg probably says things to people all the time. In fact, I have it on good authority that he says hello to people's mothers a lot. Then how do you mother for me, okay? Is this an interesting story because Mark Wahlberg is super macho and afraid to show emotion normally? In that case, the patriarchy has been officially dismantled. We can stop fighting, guys. We did it. Gwyneth Paltrow shares a rare photo of her her daughter, Apple Martin, to celebrate Daughter's Day. You know what would be an even rarer picture? Photo evidence of a single one of Gwyneth Paltrow's bullshit health products working, even a little bit. Let's hope this next segment doesn't make me want to pull out my own hair, unless it's hair that needs to be pulled out, like an ingrown hair or trimming my nose hairs or something like that. Let's do this one. Yellow! Or wait, that's... Molly. Please, sir. I want some more. More? Yeah, could I have a glass of organic soy milk? I'm very health conscious. Ah, oh, jeez, could you get like a 40 watt baby instead of like 180? You misspelled chrysanthemum. Jesus Christ, Jamie, could I get a little privacy here? I have just pooped out a human head. Hey, I'm going to the Olive Garden. You want to go with me? Oh, are you kidding me? They have terrible pesto sauce. Wait, 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 wait. I don't get it. Toys R Us? That's a terrible name. That's grammatically incorrect. Well, you know, it's supposed to appeal to the families. It's like a little kid, like misspellings or something like that. Well, I think, I think I agree with it. I think it's a great idea. I got an idea for the mascot. Oh, I spilled ketchup all over my shirt again. My precious. What are we gonna do? Quick, zap him with your heat vision. <laughs> uh, did we remember to turn the oven off? Hey, we, uh, we found this baby. Do you want it? Nah. Was Kevin Bacon in Dogma? He's writing penis on the wall. So immature. Okay, your eHarmony account didn't say anything about you having trees for arms. I'm going to pour some butter on your head. Oh, that's good. Oh. Oh, my back. Pilates suck. I'm gonna be America's next top model. I wish I were good artwork. And now, we will all bow our hands. Okay, I'm feeling really good about this next one. I know, I know you're not, but you're gonna have to deal with orange. <laughs> This is where I go through an old notebook of uh, unused ideas and I use the idea. Here's an idea for a fake commercial called Placebotin. Introducing Placebotin. It's definitely a real medicine. It makes you feel real good in inside. It's already been approved by the Federal Drug and Internal Revenue Service, so buy it today. It'll cure uh, anything that might already go away on its own. Uh, Placebotin. You might be sick until this. <laughs> Aren't you glad I didn't use that idea? Okay, what's gonna be next? Oh, I didn't take out the other ones I've already done. That's okay, we'll just do Blue Cube. Blue Cube for the imaginary biscuit. I might have a ghost in my house. What should I do? Well, there are a lot of stray ghosts wandering around who wish they had a forever home, so maybe you should just adopt it. You're gonna probably need to pick up some ghost chow. I think they have it in the pet section of Whole Foods. <laughs> Blue Cube from Mustard's Fire 22. Horrors? Um, no, we're all out. Uh, is diet horror okay? What would diet horror be? M. Night Shyamalan films? Yeah. Blue Q from Sir Neutral. Can you origami a human? There's paper in the trash, which is fitting, so... There you go. That's humanity in origami form. Next. Blue Q from Mike Prentice. Like a Pokemon, you are evolving. What does your next evolution look like? Oh, I think he's right. I think I feel it. Here we go. My hoodie is inside out now. And that's the extent of it. Hey, you got more blue cues, leave them in the comments below. Did you see me just get excited because I remembered to do that part? <laughs> well, that's it for the Rainbow Show. Be sure to do all the stuff that people do on YouTube. I mean, like, like and share, not leave racist comments. There's some more Rainbow Show episodes over there. It was weird. And remember to forget, um, th uh, things that make you mad.